Hello guys, this video was going to be for Sagittarius. It's intended for Sagittarius Sun, though it may also resonate with Sagittarius Moon and Sagittarius Rising. Please make sure to check out your Sun, your Moon, and your Rising Sign video as you may resonate more fully with that aspect of your personality during any given time. Also keep in mind, though I say this is you, it can be the other person, so don't get offended if this is not you. Also, if it doesn't resonate, it most likely has to do with somebody around you, something that affects you, but you don't know it yet. But in some cases, it's just not your reading. And that's okay too. So, excavate is one of the words that I'm getting right now. Somebody might try and maybe trying to excavate some information um, in the archives. I don't know what this means. There's something like that. Something about excavating some information from the archives, doing research. Um, I'm also hearing negotiations. Um, following a paper trail. For some of you, this is going to resonate. For others, it's not. Um, and I just heard the word vindictive. So somebody may have been vindictive. There may be investigations going on around that. For some of you, of course, that's not going to be for every Sagittarius or their Sagittarius person. Persons, whatever. All right, let's see what's coming up for Sagittarius. I was planning on doing a live. I didn't want to put on makeup today, so I'm doing this little, um, what is it called, the filters? All right, if these cards don't come out, I'm just gonna do the reading without cards. I'm gonna tell you what I feel, but there went one. Being very extra vigilant about something here, Sagittarius, at work. Maybe this is the investigation that I was talking about. Are you being investigated at work or is somebody being investigated at work? Is it you or maybe you're a Capricorn um, or both? I'm um, something about a time limit. I don't know what this is about. You're trying to recover. Oh boy, it sounds like you're the guilty one. If it's not, I don't know, you're dealing with somebody who's very guilty, whatever this is, because of what I told you that I felt. For some of you, you could have been in a work relationship with a Capricorn or a Libra, and you're being investigated, and it's time sensitive type of thing, and you're trying to recover. Some of you, because of your affair, you had an affair at work. It doesn't have to be that. It doesn't have to be an affair at work. But for some of you, it has something to do with an affair at work. For others of you, you may have decided that this investigation is going on. So I'm going on vacation. I'm going to leave. I'm going to be gone so that they can't um, talk to me or address me, I'm hearing. Um... There's something about somebody being in tune. I don't know what that means. I don't know if it has to do with music or somebody who just knows what's coming next or knows what's up. Could be something like that, either way. But I'm seeing for a lot of you, it's definitely an affair and this is something that you're hoping to keep going. All right, let's see what's coming up next. You're trying to act like the stoic. Yeah, this is definitely an affair. Something about 
an affair in the past. That doesn't mean that you're not still doing it, but at this particular stage, this is saying this is, this is a situation from the past or a situation that you have a history of doing and then trying to control the danger that it entails. So some of you may be just habitual cheaters or you may be dealing with a habitual cheater. For others, it may be some sort of sexual situation that went on at work and in the past and you're trying to control it. Um, for some of you, this could be somebody who was involved in sex work or it could be having an affair at work. I'm seeing different um, things about this. You're trying to maintain your stability as it relates to a work situation, but because of this affair, you're being very vague, meaning that you're not telling the truth about this affair. You're keeping it hidden and you're keeping the conflicts going. I just feel like somebody who's not trying to not answer the questions. So even if it's not sexual, Sagittarius, if you're being investigated or somebody around you is being investigated, the, the person being investigated is being very vague and is avoiding answering questions. Trying to let time run out, hoping that it'll just go away. wasn't supposed to come out yeah this was these cards are not going to be counted in the reading but this is somebody revolting and then celebrating not not taking care of business actually I will leave it there that's fine um, this is somebody revolting and just loving every minute of not answering the, the questions or telling the truth about the situation somebody's avoiding the law um, I'm also hearing, I'm not going to go there. I'm just going to leave that alone. Never mind. Um, so you're being very vague about some sort of sexual situation or an affair. You're conflicted. You were vigilant in the past to end someone's recovery and control it. And you sub celebrated because it was sexual and you were fearful because you knew, you know, about it but you tried to pretend like you didn't. You tried to avoid the situation. You did everything you could not to answer the questions of officials. Um, that's for some of you. For others, it could be that you're not answering somebody at work or you're not answering your family about it, you know. But the, the problem is that somebody else was trying to recover and you ended it all because of a, a sex thing, whatever that means. So what else? Yeah, I'm just going to leave it at that. I feel like some of you, this may be coming back on you. You did, Because you didn't tell the truth, like say for instance, it was a, an affair at work and the person's wanting to come back to work or some sort, of, some sort of situation is bringing them back to work, but it's catching you because you didn't tell the truth that something sexual happened or that you ended their ability to recover in the past. It could be something like that. All right, let's go on to the tarot. First card out was the guilt conscience. What else do we have for Sagittarius? Now remember this may be the same reading. It may be a continuation of the same reading or it may be a completely totally different reading. My grammar is completely off today. Some of you literally may be dealing with government officials because I just saw the Hierophant. All right, let's see. Did 
Do we have any cards for Sagittarius? What's going on for Sagittarius? We've got a couple of them right there. It says you were happy about some sort of new beginning. Could involve a Leo person or... Um, nah, it's just coming up as Leo. Leo or um, Aries. You were happy about a new beginning, it says. Passionate about it, even. New growth, new potential was your thought. Maybe you felt a sense of freedom in some sense of the word. For some of you, this may be about a child. That's going to be for a very select few. Let's see if anything else is going to come out. Sagittarius, please. Hmm. Why do I get the feeling that you have a hard time being vulnerable? There's something about having a hard time being vulnerable. course, this is not going to be every Sagittarius, but it's going to be some of you. That's all that wants to come out. You're happy about a new beginning. Happy about a new beginning choice. With this, like this, though, this could be that a choice that you're not making because she's got the blindfolds on and she's sitting still. So you were happy with making a new beginning choice or being indecisive about a new beginning choice. Refusing to see the truth about a situation and transform it. Maybe this was your way of silencing someone or someone silencing you. This is getting old. I'm already tired of trying to draw the cards for y'all. There it goes. Now you're defensive and trying to be strong. There's a lot of Leo energy here. There may be a lot of Leo in your chart too, though. It's kind of, I kind of see where it's like there's a... Oh. Okay. So I was going to say... It's kind of like you were happy about this new beginning choice, being indecisive or not making moves that you needed to make. Now it looks like you're trying to protect yourself. You're defensive. You're trying to be strong about work backstabbing. And I think I did say something about that in the previous reading. I feel like you're trying to this is you or someone else at your job if you work. Um, but this can be just a situation you're working on if you don't work. So just take it like that, okay? I'm just going to say at work. You're trying to be strong about work backstabbing. So I feel like as it relates to the work situation, somebody's being investigated as it relates to this work backstabbing. And it's like you were happy to let things slide without being adjusted and taken care of properly, but now you're having to answer for the work backstabbing or this is somebody that you're dealing with. A lot of Leo, like I said. So you could be a Leo person or it could be you. Could be any sign, truthfully. You backstabbed a will, inheritance, settlement, 
family assets, a family business. I see this as, because uh, it's talking about a recovery. This is where somebody went on work leave and you backstabbed their payout for most of you. You backstabbed somebody's payout. Or someone did this to you. I feel like you're being investigated. I really do. Especially after I saw the Hierophant. Oh, someone tells the truth. Somebody tells the truth. That is truth energy. Could be a Libra person involved as well. If you did do this, I hate to say it, but I hope you are being investigated because that's not right. And when I say that, like, I don't wish bad on anybody, but when somebody is entitled to something like that, that means they've been through something really bad. Someone told the truth that you hid it. Or someone told the truth about what you hid. And this does look like investigation. This is like spying. This is being watched. I said that before. It's also paranoia. Yeah. This is you not wanting to confess. This is you maybe even worried about going to prison for some of you. But this is somebody who is refusing to see the truth. We've got blindfolds again, um, trapped in her own thoughts, in her own words, in her own deeds, so to speak. This is that what comes around, goes around kind of energy is what I think. Okay, so it basically at the bottom of the deck, it's you're in a mental prison hoping that an apology will end for some work backstabbing. Yeah. I don't make the rules. That's what came up for you guys, and I've been seeing this for a while. You really need to stop it. I mean, if this is you... You really need to stop this. Stop trying to take away somebody else's well-being just because your ego hurts. This is this is really ugly energy. Um, what else do I see? Yeah, for some of you, there may be there may be something where whoever this person is, there must be something, not for all, there must be something about this person coming back for some of you. Because it looks like you backstabbed the somebody's new beginning and hid it so that an apology would end. Something like that. Something like that. I feel like you backstab somebody's money. That's what I feel like. And I'm hoping and praying that you guys will, because this has been going on for a long time. Get out of your head. Get out of your ego. Money can be remade. You know what I'm saying? I don't even think it's about the, the money so much as it is your ego. That's how I feel. I could be wrong. Somehow you keep getting away with, with hiding that you backstab this money unjustly. 
But like I said, when I saw the Hierophant before, I have a feeling some of you are being investigated. That's not going to be for all of you. But you were trying to keep this situation legally stuck for a long, long time. All right, guys. Please make sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Um, make sure to subscribe to Apocalyptic Tarot as well as Triple Moon Meditations because those are both my channels too. If you're able to leave a donation, there's a link in the description box. Do it, do it, do it. YouTube has gotten ridiculous. In fact, I'm about to give up because their algorithm has just gotten so bad. Um, when I say giving up, I mean going to just doing personal readings and uh, in-person readings because YouTube is just not beneficial. Um, I feel like there's something else I want to say about this reading. I don't know if I, something about taxes, something about taxes and maybe even tax law. I'm also hearing the word square. I don't know what that means. Maybe it's talking about the square app. And I also heard something about trading I don't know. Anyway, bye guys.